my wife Lisa is a, a typical missionary of the CMA because international workers in the Christian Missionary Alliance all over the world are so connected to the people that they work with. And as youth pastors in Peru for 10 years, we saw young people in our church that were growing up with great musical abilities. Many of them are very challenged economically. Some of them lived in thatched roofs and mud homes. And yet they had these great gifts that God had given them for music. So they started a band. We thought it'd be a band that would just kind of fizzle out after a week or two. But after two years, my wife was invited to be a part of the band. And so she got in the band and little by little, this band began to grow and into a missionary band. You know what their goal was? To go to the small towns where no other band would ever go and present the gospel in a concert form. And so they've gone to, to, to towns in Ecuador and in Peru where there may only be four or five hundred people in the whole town where two or three hundred people came to the concert. Why? Because nobody goes there. This is like a new thing. And so they go to these small towns and, and make a difference for the gospel. And this, this group, Corban, it's C-O-R-B-A-N, and you can look them up in the web as well, CorbanWeb.com, and they are just passionate about the Lord. And they had the privilege after they got their visas for the United States and Canada to do a tour last June through December. So they went to Puerto Rico, they went through the eastern United States, the eastern Canada and Ontario, and did concerts. They did 167 concerts in 167 days. It was a killer. Over 67 churches. We'd do sometimes seniors' homes. We'd go to orphanages and sing. We'd go to public schools. Anywhere we could go just to, to worship the Lord and, and bring the people with us to worship the Lord as well. So they did think, songs in English and Spanish. They're on iTunes now. You can look them up on iTunes as well. Just put Corbin Peru and you can find their songs, worship songs in both languages. And music is one of those tools that God has used throughout the history for young people. And young people just, they gravitate to music. And this band has salsa, some Latin salsa in their band. They have some Christian rock and they have other songs. Many of their songs they've written themselves. And their passion is how can we take the gospel all over the world and reach the majority of the 300 million youth in Latin America with Christ's irresistible love. Two of the band members after the tour, we gained enough money in our love offerings that we were able to help Two of these band members now are working as international workers. They're Peruvians, but they're working in Ecuador, helping raise up youth ministries and music ministries in the smaller congregations where they're struggling. They don't have anybody to do that. And their goal is to go to some creative access nation someday as an international worker and make a difference in this world. So keep praying for Corbin, for my wife Lisa as she sings in the band, and for the future of this band as they, they seek to reach many young people for Christ.